Hey everyone, my name is Vladimir Enchev and in this video I'm gonna show you how to pass a parameter to a page in Radzen. Let's start with an empty application and a single data source, SQL Server, connected to Northwind database. Let's create a page called Customers and bind a data grid component to customers table. We will allow paging, sorting and filtering. OK. So we want now to enable edit and update of the customers and we will need additional page to edit the customer. Let's create it. Edit customer. Click save. And let's add a form component to edit the customer. We will select the schema as customer and how to generate the form fields. We need, we need now, however, to fill this form when the page is loaded. We can do this if we execute on page load get customer by customer ID. We need, however, to specify the customer ID. Let's pretend that we have passed already a parameter called customer ID to this page. And we will assign the result to a page property called customer. We can bind the form data to this customer. And let's now add a submit event. To update the customer, we need to invoke update customer method. And again, we need to specify parameters. Customer ID from page parameters. Customer ID. And the actual customer from form submit event argument. Then we will execute close dialog action since we plan to open edit customer page as a dialog. By the way, edit customer page should not be part of the navigation. Let's exclude it. Okay, so we want now when we select a customer to open the edit customer page. Let's assign a row select action, open dialog and select edit customer as path. We can now pass a parameter to this page by adding a parameter to the parameters collection. The name is customer ID and the value we will get it from event argument customer ID. OK, so let's see this in action. Run the application.
and let's try to edit the first customer. When you select a row in the data grid component, we will open an edit customer page. We pass a customer ID as a parameter and we load a customer from the database using this parameter. Let's update something. Click save and region is updated. That's all for now. Thanks for watching.